Hey guys, my name is Chaotic and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys a glitch on Grand Theft Auto 5 Online on the Xbox One and PlayStation 4 which allows you to walk through walls and wall breach into buildings and secret locations. So let's get straight into this video so I can show you guys how this glitch is done. Now the glitch itself works at any location where there is a glass door or window and it's a very simple process so simply what you want to do is find yourself some form of glass door or window. You can see in the video I'm using the police station as an example and simply what you want to do is stand up next to the glass door or window then open the interaction menu then enable passive mode and straight afterwards disable it then you can back out of the interaction menu then hold forward on your analog stick pushing towards the window and at the same time you want to run towards the window now obviously it's not going to show that motion because you're up against the wall but by doing so once the passive mode timer in the bottom right hand corner runs out you're then going to start sliding towards the window or the door and you're then going to wall breach straight through and be inside the secret location or the building which you've tried to get into. So there you go, with that very simple method you can easily get yourself into any secret location or building very quickly in just a few seconds. Now as previously mentioned, you can use this glitch method at any location where there is a glass door or window to get into the building behind them. Now in the video I've used the police station as an example because there are some very cool locations and features inside the police station. But towards the end of the video, I'm going to be showing you guys a second example where I get into the Fleeker Bank near the Los Santos Customs. The discovery of this glitch will certainly lead to a lot of new secret locations being found because most buildings around the map of Los Santos have some form of glass door or window. But anyway, going back to the police station, now I do have a valid reason for showing you guys this location over some of the other locations which I could have featured in this video. Now the police station itself is quite an interesting building. There are some rooms which you can get into, for example the staircase. You can go up the staircase towards the roof, although you can't actually go onto the roof because there is a locked door at the top of the stairs. There are also some interactive features inside the police station, for example the Sprunk soda machine which you can buy drinks from. But anyway, what you can also do now is get back out of any building which you have wall breached yourself into by using the exact same glitch method. So go up to the door, open the interactive menu, then enable and disable passive mode. Then you want to hold forward on your analog stick towards the door, as well as hold the run button on your controller. And as soon as the passive mode time runs out, you'll then start to slide through the door and you'll then be on the other side in just a matter of seconds. And there you have it, that is how you would use the same glitch to get yourself back out of the secret location or the inside of the building which you originally got into. Now as previously promised, I'm going to be showing you guys a second example of another location which you can also get into by using the exact same method. This location of course being the Fleeker Bank near the Los Santos Customs. But apart from that guys, that is all I have for this video, but I do hope you have enjoyed it and I hope you enjoy using this glitch on GTA 5 Online. If you guys could take a few seconds out of your day to click the like button, it would help me out a lot and it's also greatly appreciated. Also be sure to leave a comment on this video and tell me what you thought of this glitch. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, I already recommend that you do, because I upload all the latest and the greatest Grand Theft Auto 5 content. So anyway guys, thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time.